2K Sports and the PGA Tour. Proud to bring you the season-long race for the FedEx Cup. Today's coverage of the Skipjack Open is about to begin. Delighted to have your company for this final round action. I'm Luke Elvey, here alongside Rich Beam. And Rich, this next golfer starts their round. What do you think about their chances? Luke, it's a small lead, but listen, it's better than trailing, isn't it? I like this player's chances. They've been playing rock solid the first three rounds. Even though the chasing pack does have some pretty heavy-duty names, this player has shown me the goods all week long. Big day coming up. Can't wait to see how it unfolds, Rich. This should be an absolute beauty. Okay, not the best result, but a chance to get up and down. Can't fault him there. This rough is nasty. No fault in missing the green. Oh, that's great. It just missed the hole. Big power saver coming up for this fella. In she goes. Let's head to the next. He's currently just in second place. Time to tee off at the second. And after a part of the last, chance to maybe take a step in the right direction here. to have opted for the eight iron come on get down good shot there slim chance here for birdie but you never know and let's take a look at this shot from moments ago. Matt Kuchar with a fantastic shot. Lining up for his third now. And back to the course with the live action. You've left yourself a long way between the holes, so Let's get this one close. <whistles> Par putt coming up here. Yeah, well hold. Let's move on to the next. And staying right where they were in today's rankings after that. You've arrived at a par five. Well, well played. Playing this shot from around 220 yards here. Wind is blowing from right to left here. Wants to work it against the wind. Going with the hybrid. This one is heading to a really not so good space. Getting ready to play their third.
How close was that to going in the hole? Great shot. What an opportunity to make a birdie. And after that effort, let's take a look at how it stands. He's currently sitting in second. Tea is yours. Here we are at the fourth hole. Nice birdie in the last hole for a change. First one of the day. They needed it desperately. Now, next hole, looking for more. Seems like they've got an abundance of swing thoughts going on there. Perhaps paralysis by analysis. That got caught up in a few of the branches. Oh, this is not a good outcome. Buried in the deep stuff. Birdie on this hole yesterday, but highly doubtful from the lie they have today. Might get caught up in the brush here. This would be a momentum saver here, getting this up and down. That's amazing. Out of the rough, into the hole. Thank you very much. That shot's so good, we need to have another look. The leader now has a one-stroke advantage. Oh, I always love these holes. Here we have a par three. Going with the six iron here. What happened there? That's not the outcome they were after. Oh, the win wreaks havoc with another golf ball. Sadly, hasn't made a putt all day. Hopefully that can change here. Get in the hole. Just remember to get that nice rhythm in your stroke. Downhill putt. And he certainly was robbed on that effort. And the putt drops, and we're moving on. Trailing by a couple of strokes now. And on the tee now, coming off the bogey. Might have a bit of a sting in the tail, I'd imagine. That was absolutely murdered. Second shot here on the sixth.
and choosing the eight iron here. This one's headed towards the rough. And here we are with the third shot. Only two shots off the pace. went in this putt is about 15 feet to the hole Well, what a way to bounce back. Nice putt to hold. And just keeping it in neutral on the leaderboard. Lovely momentum for this player after that birdie at the last hole. Keep it rolling. Looks to be going with a hybrid here. That's a shame. Just leaking left, that one. That's going to find the water, sadly. Getting ready to play their third. Two strokes off the lead. Well played, mate. And this next putt, it's for bogey. Good putt, that. current leader is enjoying a two-stroke lead. We've reached the eighth hole. The tee is yours. Oh, well struck. This drive's heading for the fairway in my eyes. And the effort, that one. And this has been a hole he's unable to take advantage of so far for this event. And that's their fourth booty of the day. Just two shots back after that hole. Always positive coming off a birdie. Let's see what happens here.
This is the second shot here on the ninth hole. Opting for the six iron. Well, you're in the hands of the tree gods now. Didn't quite strike that as cleanly as they would have hoped. And coming up well short. Opportunity here, just six feet to the hole. Oh, nice line. Yep, nice to make a mid range par putt. Rich, this player's just a few shots back with the last nine to play. Did you prefer to be the Greyhound or the Bunny? Three strokes down with nine to go, Luke. They're going to have to come up with something sporty to get to the top of the leaderboard at day's end. That's a good looking shot there. Looks like a similar approach to yesterday. They had a good result yesterday. Can't see why they wouldn't have another good one today. Going with the pitching wedge here. Yeah, that one's looking good. Not a bad approach. Grab the putter from the caddy. You're dancing. Lining up the birdie putt here. Good stuff today, especially the short game has been really sharp today. Fair effort, that. Good birdie. John, what's going on? Talk to us, Goose. We're down here watching Matt Kuchar on the 14th hole. And after that hole, this is how the leaderboard looks right now. Our leader is a couple of shots up at this stage. Managing to chase down the leaders, closing that gap. Got to like it. They're going with the pitching wedge. That's not what they were looking for. Coming up a little short with that effort. Not bad, though. Oh, that one just missed the hole. Let's see if you can make this. Keep the power on the card. And down it goes. Trailing by a couple of strokes now. Let's see what happens here at the 12. That's tiny.
We need this one to bounce right. But not a bad approach. Will be putting. This putt to move into a tie for first. He was on a good line. He's got a par putt here. Let's see if he can make it. Well, that hole's behind us. More to play. He's currently in the second position. Let's see what happens here at the 13th. Well done. Uh, it's a brave one. Driver off the deck. And here we are with the third shot. Just a stroke behind the leader. Oh, that's great. It just missed the hole. That's the spirit. Well played. Just go ahead and tap this in for birdie. Gee, that's good playing. Six birdies in a round. And there's no movement on the leaderboard after that hole. This hole here is a par four. John, what's this one looking like? I don't know how much of this one they can get. Uh, it ended up quite, uh, quite deep down into this rough. Looks to be going with the six iron. Yeah, nicely played. Slim chance for a birdie. But in all reality, two putt for par would be just fine. Oh, he's up, Tiger. This putt about 11 feet in distance. This one's tracking. Yeah, nothing to sweat over that one. We'll hold. Let's have a look at Bryson DeChambeau's effort. Sitting at five under par in their round. Gee, that'll keep the momentum rolling, Rich. Saving one there after being all over the parking lot, chipping in for the par. Let's take a look at the leaderboard as it stands. Our current leader is enjoying a one-shot lead. We find ourselves on a par three here.
chosen the pitching wedge here. Not a bad shot, that. Still a chance. And this putt is for a big two on the scorecard. Ooh. This part of about six feet coming up. Nice stroke. And down she goes. And they're going to have to really focus in here to try and chase down that leader. Just two shots back after that hole. Let's see what happens here at the 16th. Let's finish with a flurry. It'd be nice to make a move up the leaderboard. Opting for the four iron here. This is a risk-reward game, Rich. They took plenty of risk, but they're going to get the reward. Absolutely, Luke. Trailing by two, you can tie the lead if should they make the putt. All right, John. How's this putt looking? This looks like around 29 feet. Anything in five feet would be handy from here. I really hope this one drops for him. Yeah, that's well judged. Oh, what a round this is. Seven birdies today. Our current leader is enjoying a two-stroke lead. Let's see what happens here at the 17th. Opting for the five iron. Oh, this one's right down the pipe. Whoa, what a massive play if they can get this one up and down. Clutch even. Oh, wouldn't that have been nice? Well, these are the kind of putts that bring out the best in players. Do you think this person's clutch? We're certainly going to find out momentarily, Luke. Solid par putt, that. He's currently just in second place. Teeing off here at the lucky last, the 18. Uh, yeah, this is going to end up wet for sure. Getting ready to play their third. Three behind our leader. That looks to be a fairway finder to me. Playing their fourth shot. Pretty good win, back into the player's face. That was never really a comfortable shot for them, was it? Oh, look at that, the wind just wreaking havoc with that shot, disappointing. This would be a great up and down, go ahead and make it.
this punt for a final score of 67. A good stroke. Bit too heavy handed there. Double bogey putt coming up here. And with that putt, that'll bring his tournament to a close. Is this a case of so close yet so far? Yes, there's no doubt. Left a lot of strokes out there. Could have taken the lead early in the round, just didn't get it done. Well, on behalf of myself, Luke Elby and Rich Beam, thanks for tuning in. Catch you tomorrow.